I think you've had about enough. I'll get that shit fucking later. Where's Al? I let him sleep it off. God bless. Whatever, man. Let's just enjoy the peace and quiet. I mean, I love him, but the kid's an idiot. Come on, man, you weren't that much different a few years back. Just have a little patience. I'm gonna drag. Thanks. What the hell does Grandpa even see in him? I mean, this is supposed to be our trip, you know? I mean, fuck, man, he's our cousin. He looks up to us and shit. Why are you defending him? I'm not. I'm just saying that if it were me that were that hungover, you wouldn't be so nice about it. I'm just saying. Well, I'm just saying I woke up 10 minutes ago and I've already heard your dumb ass complain more than I care to. All right, all right. You just had to say we'd bring back a catfish. Do you have something you want to say to me, Freddy? Man, when's the last time you remember catching anything worthwhile around here? We've come out here dozens of times, and now all of a sudden you got a problem with it. I just don't want to be stuck out here any longer than we have to. Well, looks like you're in luck, then, pal. All right, watch this shit. First try. Told you we should have gone further downstream. That's where Grandpa would go. What, and drag Alice hung over ass all the way down there? I think I'll pass. This is why we shouldn't have brought him. Just relax, man. A couple feet's not gonna change our luck. Shit luck is shit luck. You know, just one time, man. One time I wanna catch something bigger than the old man. Like his biggest fish he's ever seen. Kind of a high standard. Old man's been out here for years. We're out here maybe once or twice a winter. Yeah? Well, I intend on catching some pretty damn good before he dies on us. Man, do you ever feel like he's just fucking with us about the whole catfish thing anyway? What do you mean? Yeah, we've seen some decent sized fish over the years, but I'm sorry, the thing that he's got above the fireplace is fucking ridiculous. Maybe he just buys them at the fish market. I don't know, that sounds like something you would do. Hell no. We can't go back there. That old fucking Chinese dude hates our guts. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit, man. All right, well, come on. But, but you just said- Yeah, well, I'm unsaying it. You know, we're not going back home until we got something to rub grandpa's nose into. Come on, man, it's probably better like you said. What about Al? Look who's finally giving a shit about their cousin. And just let him sleep it off. We'll check him out every once in a while. Are you coming or not?
Spot seem good to you? Yeah. Yo, are you good? Yeah. All right. All right, man. I'm gonna go check on Al. Fine. What? What? What's the problem? Nothing. Don't even start with that. Just spit it out. I feel like you let Grandpa get in your head too easily. Oh, and this is coming from the lower level headedness here. I'm serious, man. This used to be kind of fun. Man, I'm still having fun. And you're trying to tell me you don't want to stick to the old man? Of course I do. Then what the fuck? You changed, man. Ever since you left. That's what this is about? This is why you're being a mopey bitch? You're never home. You left. And now I'm stuck dealing with Grandpa and Grandpa's bullshit. Yeah, well, whose fault is that? You're the one who dropped out. Maybe if you gave shit about anything, you wouldn't be in this situation. But no, of course Freddy had to be special. So do me a favor and save me this self-pity bullshit, because I don't want to fucking hear it. God damn, man, it's no wonder Grandpa sends us out here. Just try to see if anybody can't teach you how to grow the fuck up! Ugh! You scared the fish away? Probably. We'll check on Al. Probably. How's it going there, Al? Need some help with that, man? <laughs> 